All right, welcome back to GeoGuessr. I had a lot of people suggesting last time I do the United States only map, so I just gave that a little try to see what it was gonna look like. It's not good. All the roads look exactly the same. They're in the middle of nowhere with trees around them, and I have no idea what state any of it is in. So, not gonna be a good call. Uh, we're just gonna stick to the map of the world because I feel like at least I can get some subtle clues from language on signs and the surroundings versus every road looking identical. All right, what do we got here? What do we have here? We have a cafe, what does it say? Uh, Steve's Cafe 47. Oh, dude, it doesn't even have an area code on it. Okay, so that means the people are, we're implying that it's a bunch of locals only going to this cafe and where though? Any indication as to what state this is in though? North Wildwood Stone Harbor. Don't know where those are. I'm looking, I'm spending a little bit more time than I usually usually would because I feel like I'm just gonna get a real nice clue at some point here real quickly. Mm, still don't know where this is. Even you guys, no. Nobody wants to name their company as like, Discount Hydraulics of Enter City here. Okay, that's fine. I don't know why I'm, get a I'm getting a feeling it's like a, maybe a Michigan. Or something like that. I'm getting a feeling it's maybe uh, we're near the Great Lakes. I don't know why, but I could also be completely off. But I'm going to guess somewhere over here. Let's go for it. Are we anywhere? Okay, 581 miles. We're, uh, wow, we were over in uh, New Jersey. It's not terrible. Could be worse. Not the best. Not the best. Hey, at least I had the, uh, the more eastern United States feel going, right? I was completely off base there. Uh, where are we now? Oh, this looks really nice. Okay, well, we know we're somewhere in Europe, right? We got that. So, you know, at least uh, if we get somewhere in the middle, we're probably going to end up kind of close to where this is. Austria. Okay, I think we're in Italy somewhere. This looks fairly Italian, you know? Okay, so some where in Italy would this be? Where would a mountainous region be in Italy? I am going to be so off base here, but I'm going to guess somewhere... I'm gonna guess somewhere in like this area and probably com be completely wrong, but not bad. 125 miles away, I got the northern part of Italy. I was even thinking for a second I was gonna put it closer to Genoa and then, man, it would have been even closer. Okay, we're doing all right, we're doing all right. Let's see if I can best my high score. This seems like the United States to me. Maybe it's not the US. I don't know why, it just looks kind of United States-esque to me, but I could be completely wrong. I can't really get, it's not English though. Okay, so I guess, I don't think we're in the United States. Never mind, never mind. What do you know? 250 meters to a snowmobile crossing. Are we somewhere in Europe actually? That's uh oh, 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 oh. What if we are in, oh, I have an idea. What if we're near like Montreal or something? That would be a good hybrid between it looking kind of North American and also not being English. Okay, this is, I'm, I'm pulling this guess way out from I don't know where, but I am gonna go, I'm gonna go for that. I'm gonna go for that. Okay, I don't know, maybe maybe somewhere in this area? Let's just go near Montreal and, and see what happens. Not bad, not bad, we got this. Okay, hoo hoo. Yeah, I had a feeling it might not have been like right on the Great Lakes, something like that, but okay, dude. Almost 4,000 points, 310 miles, we're doing okay. 11,000 and I still have, I could best my high score here. Uh, let's see what this sign says over here. Any Anything, Fort Alexander. Where's Fort Alexander? I don't know, but I, I'm pretty sure we're in the United States. So, for, someone right now is like, I live right near Fort Alexander. Could possibly be Canada. Let's scroll around and just, let's see. If we can get any other indicators. Dude, someone right now is yelling that they live really close to that and they know exactly where it is. <laughs> like, I would get this down within like five feet of the actual location. Oh, I don't know though. I don't know. I'm feeling more East Coast, but it also could be Canada. I'm gonna put another down right in this area. It's almost the same place I guess the first round, but we're just gonna go here. It was Canada. It was Canada! Again! Shoot! I should have stuck with my gut and just gone with Canada. I don't know why I didn't. Granted, I don't know that I would have put it up there near Winnipeg, but still, I should have just gone with it. Okay, that's fine. We can still redeem ourselves here. Rumba Latina. Are we in South America or are we in Central America? I'm feeling South America on this one. This is actually really beautiful scenery here. This is really nice. I kind of want to go here. 
Man, we've gotten two just beautiful locations that we've been dropped into here, haven't we? This is awesome. Wow, wherever this is, I kind of, look at this view. This is, what a beauty. Man, oh man. Okay, so I'm trying to think. It's probably like uh, Chile or Argentina. I feel like those tend to be known for their very beautiful views. I also could not be there, but I could be completely off base. I feel like if I think it's Mexico, it's actually going to be South America. If I think it's South America, it's actually going to be Mexico. But still, I don't even care. I'm going to go I'm going to go here. I'm going to go here. Come on. Give it to me. Shoot. Shoot. It was in Ecuador. Yeah, I got the South America part, but dang it. I don't know that there was much more I could have gone off of. Maybe the, the Latino sign made it should have brought me a bit more north. I thought I was going to beat my uh my record, but I, I don't think I did. 14,000. Oh, that one killed me. That one killed me. Look at these ones super close. Okay, it's fine. Let's do it again here, boys. Let's do it again. Let's make things happen. That's, there's nothing to go off of here whatsoever. Can I get a sign? Yeah, no? That's just a bunch of trees with a road in between them. Oh boy. Uh, it doesn't look like the US, if that means anything. Cause, but also it could be. Any any signs? Anybody? Oh, hey, here here's a sign. I love signs. Signs are really good. Uh, oh, Russia. It's, okay, it's Russian. All right. That's actually, I was thinking, I was thinking it could be a Russian thing. I say that, and I should have said it before when I was actually thinking it, and, it, and then you would have believed me more, but I don't know where. Let's just, you know, probability suggests it's somewhere in this area as opposed to Eastern Russia, so let's just make that guess. All right, it, it wasn't in Russia, it was in Ukraine, but that's okay. That is okay, because we still got quite a few points for it. On to the next round. Kind of a similar situation. You know, this, when it was the US, all the roads that I got dropped on looked exactly like the last one, just, you know, with the yellow line in the middle and all that. But I was like, all right, this is not helpful at all. I'm never gonna guess what state this is in. Uh, I don't think this is the United States either, though. I'm almost thinking somewhere in Europe, probably. I don't know Russia, though. Give me a sign. Something. Something down the road here. Give me some architecture. Okay. Beautiful architecture. Very... Oh, uh, is that a Swedish flag that I see there? Is that a uh, Sweden? Okay, we got some Sweden going on here. Thank you guys for being so very patriotic. You're saving my skin. Well, hey, probability would suggest it's gonna be closer to Stockholm because that's where more of the roads are gonna be that have street views. So, just guess somewhere outside of Stockholm. 147 miles. It looked a little bit more rural, so I probably should have thought, you know, maybe a little bit more north, but that's fine. I appreciate the patriotism, guys. Very, very good. Very nice. <laughs> okay, what do we got here? What do we got here? Um, what the language could this be? Actually, it's kind of reminding me of uh, the Polish um, stuff in that last one where everyone was like, Jordan, you're an idiot. PL Poland, obviously. Why would PL mean Czech Republic, you dum dum? And I completely agree in retrospect. I just didn't pull Poland out for some reason, but I'm assuming somewhere in that it. Wait, this has a C and a Z next to it. So maybe this actually is Czech Republic. Hold on, let's go. Can we find a website somewhere, huh? Anybody uh, got a website listed anywhere? Hey, you know what, if I guess Czech Republic, I don't think I'll be too terribly far away regardless, so, um... Let's see. You know, I'm seeing a lot of C's and Z's next to each other. So, it's making me think it could... Media expert! You guys want to figure out how to be YouTube experts? Go to media expert. They got the best in expertise when it comes to internet medias. I'm just gonna go Czech Republic. I'm gonna go near Prague. It's gonna... It, wait, is that like... No, I don't. Mm. I'm sure there's some clues here that I should really be getting from the colors of flags and whatnot, but I just don't know enough, and I'm so terribly sorry. I'm so uneducated. Let's just go here, make that guess, and we were. God dang it, Poland! It was Poland again! Ah! I'm so sorry. I don't know how to speak Polish, and I'm sure people who do were like, dude, that's obviously Polish language. I don't know. At least we weren't too far away. God damn it. Just when in doubt, go Poland and not Czech Republic, apparently. Oh boy. This is uh, this is somewhere in the US, but where? Don't know. You know, the US, it's known for its uh, good old road signs that tell you how many miles to the nearest city. So it'd be great to find one of those. But it looks, this looks like it could be kind of like Pacific Northwest. 
Let's, oh, don't, don't you fail me. We're going to go somewhere in the middle of Oregon and hope that that's right. That's really far up there. I would not have, nope, wouldn't have guessed that one. That's like, it's like all snow, except I, I guess in the summer when it's, it's not snow, but yeah, that's, that's real far away. Okay. I didn't even know Google Maps went, well, in fairness, I have actually gone to like the remote ends of Alaska just to see where Google Maps will go. So they do go, they're very committed to their job. I will say that, but that is going to mess up my score. Okay. We can still, if I could get a good round here, we're still at 13,000. It's not the end of the world. Somewhere in Europe. I know that for sure. Okay. Nope. Nope. Definitely. We should just guess Ukraine. I'm going to guess Ukraine and it's going to be Schrodinger's cat. If I guess Russia, it's going to be in Ukraine. If I guess Ukraine, it's going to be in Russia. If I don't guess either of them, it's going to be somewhere else. Let's guess Ukraine. Why not? Let's do it. But we'll go closer to Russia. It's right here. Boom. You got, it was in Ukraine, just not on that side of Ukraine. Not the worst. 17,000 points is actually pretty good. And if it weren't for this garbage over here, we'd be doing a lot better. So, okay, I'll take that. It could be a lot worse. Well, anyway, that was another round of GeoGuessr. I hope you've enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. And uh, make sure to like if you like, check the playlist in the description if you want to catch more of these videos. Um, subscribe if you're not already. And if you want to catch music playing in the background right now, link in the outro. It's over on Mirror Music. I'll see you later. Bye.